For so long I was living my life Oh, so wrong Always numb in my mind That old on Building scars from the night So far gone I was blind So now that I found what I Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel In case you are new here My good name is Zipi Nyangweso Thank you for clicking on this Today's video is all about apartment tour I'm so, I'm so excited to share with you place where i live feel free feel at home grab a cup of coffee so that you enjoy the video up to the end at the end of this video remember to give this video a thumbs up remember to subscribe if you haven't subscribed remember to share with your friends anything that motivates you let me know in the comment section what you think or how you feel about this apartment it's so minimalistic it's so minimal like minimalistic living thank you so much i hope you will be inspired and let's get straight into the video this is where the entrance for the apartment is and immediately you enter you get to see the shear and the curtains right there as you can see the shear has some details in it as well as the curtains I really wanted the super neutral theme for this house and therefore I went for this color. Yes, down there we have the doormat. As you all know, we've had this doormat even from the previous house. I really like it. It is super cool and fit for the purpose. Moving on to the right, that is where my strand is. I usually place my keys and the handbags there. I really wanted to have a console table there and the mirror somewhere there, but unfortunately, I haven't found the right piece for that area. Up there, we have the lighting for the room. Yes, we have that lighting. Yeah, but it's not coming on. I don't know why, but I'll fix it later. This is the entertainment area, guys. As you can see, we have the TV there, the TV stand with some decor pieces and the room diffuser. Yes, behind there, we have the wall socket. That is where I connect my TV from. Yes, the TV, I got it long time ago. I got it from Jumia. The TV stand is from Tumaini Mat, our Janilipa, but let me plug you guys. Yeah. Down there, the cabinet, the TV cabinet or the TV stand comes with that uh, drawer, drawers or the compartments. That's where I keep my chargers. Don't mind the... <laughs> The way they are, Sijapanga Vizuri. We also have the other compartment or the drawer. That is where I keep my notebooks. But for the bulbs, ignore, kindly ignore them. Nilikuwa nazitesta hapo ju. And then nika find, nika pata nimeziweka hapo. We have that decor piece right there. We also have the serviette holder right there. Now, that is the view from inside as for the entrance area. Yes. Without forgetting, we have that pot and the wall art there. The pot, I'm yet to find the right plant for it. Don't mind uh, the wall art. I have placed the wall art there to decorate a little bit, at least to bring some aesthetics over that area. <laughs> Now, moving on to the left side, this is where we have the kitchen area. Let me give you an overview of the kitchen area, how it looks like. The selling point for this house was the kitchen area. Remember, it's an open kitchen plan. So, I really liked how everything looked at that moment. A lot of scrubbing was done for this this room yes remember it wasn't a newly built house so we cleaned so much so if you see some stain somewhere please kindly ignore 
to the left side of the entrance as you can see we remember i said it's an open plant kitchen so we have the fridge there we have the water dispenser as you can see we also have the curtains which are extending from the other side to this side and also from the kitchen area window you have the view of it from that side you can see i was shooting actually in the evening that's why you can see it a dark outside yes the huge window or the large window brings in so much light into the room you need not to light up the steamer when preparing meals if if it's a daytime over there we have the sink area we have the liquid soap detergents for cleaning utensils we have the cutlery holder we have the glasses over there we have the the utensil rack with um, plates and cups over there we have also the water kettle and the chopping board over there that is the socket area where I connect my electronics on my cooker we also have the spices over there decor piece i really wanted to add some goldish effect into the room and a touch of greenery in that space that is the blender and the thermos over there that is we also have the food stuffs over there they are in that co in those containers sorry we have food additives spices over there we have the cups and glasses the plates over there and the bowls up there most of you have been asking where I got the cups from. I got them long time ago from uh, Kamkunji. Yes, I got them in 2019. They were quite affordable. The huge selling point for this house was the kitchen area. As you can see, the space really speaks for itself. I like how everything is. The kitchen comes with the granite countertop. I've tried to add the silverish contact paper at least to maintain the same neutral color theme for this house the project is not yet over so we are going to add the contact paper on the other side soon <laughs> with the kitchen towels on the other side we have the pots cooking pots that stand i got it from the local shop so as to have a place to keep my pots the other side we also have the cooking pot lids down there we have the mat yes that is the mat which is running across that kitchen and over the other side as you can see we have the dustbin over there <laughs> On the countertop, as I said, if you see anything, just kindly ignore. We did a lot of scrubbing over this place, but some stains couldn't go off. So over there, we have the blender base. We also have the toaster. And then we have extra kitchen towels there. Yes, we have the extra kitchen towels. The hand paper towel over there. Without forgetting, guys, as you can see, we have that lovely plant. Yes, I wanted to add a touch of green to my kitchen area. That's why you can see the vase there with the flower, with the green part flowers. Actually, it's an artificial plant. It's only that I didn't get fresh flowers. That's why I have it there. At least you can see it brings in some aesthetics for that space. It looks really cool the flowers are from state was a good find so i really 
came up with the idea of since we don't have fresh flowers why don't we add this to add a touch of greenery to our space it looks really pretty and i like it <laughs> proceed to the living room welcome to my living room i like the way items speak on their own this is really a beauty in this space it is my second favorite space i really like it yes i wanted to maintain the orange theme because i haven't changed my carpet over the years but we are going to do so soon so I like how things are speaking on their own. I like the beauty in this space, the gold effect, the greenery part of it, and the white part of it. I really wanted it neutral with a pop of color for this space. For so long, I was living my life. For so long. Always numb in my mind that old on Building scars from the night so far gone I was blind So now that I found what I was looking for I'm shining a light on the dark that I was coming from now let's start from here we are going to start with the table yes let me give you a brief story of this table my mom calls me in 2019 tells me like we are coming over to your place we are from this place they were coming from mombasa to before they proceed to their homeland they were to pass by my place that is in nairobi and then proceed to their place Makyu, anakuja na wageni, sina hata meza. So I just walked to their nearby shop and got myself this table. That is how I bought this table. Na ever since CJ replaced, but soon we will. Now, to decorate my table, I've used that Vogue book to decorate the table. We also have that gold vase. It is from Stage Market. And the flowers are from Beautiful by Mary along Gitanga Road. <laughs> Moving on to this side, we have the seat, which is from Bosico Furnitures. It came with the black polka dotted white throw pillows. Yes, I went ahead to add the rest of the pillows. As you can see, it's a good find. I really like it. Yes, the throw pillow covers, which are in white, came from Kamkunji. And the small accent pillow is from the Smart Lady Homes. I've gone ahead to add a good fuzzy throw blanket to bring a different texture and warmth that feels quite homely warm as well as giving a relaxation vibes into this space i like the whites and the neutrals and also the pop of color coming out of that area it is so looks so good so cozy looks good as you all know We've had this flower. It was a gift from a friend. I've had it for like, I think four or five years now. It's high time. See you do I wake up, but I really like the flower. I have also added a wall art around that corner. It matches the theme of the house, as you can see from there. Essentially, it is supposed to be on the walls, but I decided I will have it right there because it looks so small for the entire space. Actually, the space needs like a bigger wall art to cover a major area for that space. Our carpet is from Jumia. I've had this carpet for so long. That's why you can see Siuko ready quick release. But soon we are going to change the theme of the house. Yes, that is how it looks. Pops of color 
in that space, the orange vibe. Now that is the view from the kitchen area. Remember it's an open plan kitchen. That is the view from the kitchen area. The coach is really giving the relaxation vibes over there. It looks so good and I really like this space. It's so minimal, so neutral, so cool with the pops of color, which blends so well with the color theme of the house. I haven't added any pediland or lighting to this room. I'm actually using what I found in this house. Now, the living room leads you to the passageway, which leads you to the bedroom and the bathroom. This is the corridor. Here I put my shoes. And as you can see, we have the laundry basket over there. We have the buckets. We also have the doormat, which is leading to the bathroom. For the other side, it is the bedroom. I haven't added any mat there. We only have that mat. We have the light switch to the bathroom. We have the shower switch right there along that corridor we as you can see we have the lighting above there i've added the warm bulb on that other side we have the mirror we have that cast think i could wipe me corner down there we have the toothbrushes which are in that container we also have the soap detergent around that sink area now let's go straight into the bathroom that is the door leading to the bathroom we have the shower curtain the shower curtain is from smart lady home i really like this space also it is so cozy looks so good I really like it. If you haven't watched the bathroom makeovers, makeover, please go ahead and watch it. We have those organizers are from Jumia. As you can see, Zina come in through for that place. We also have the dustbin for the bathroom. We have the toilet brush. We also have that tissue rack organizer. It is from House of Leather. And the other organizer towel rack is from online shop. Actually, my friend ordered it for me after I had seen it somewhere. <laughs> So above there, I've decided also that I will add a touch of greenery to each and every room apart from the bedroom. This looks super cool. I really like it. Yes, I did the bathroom makeover. You can go and check it out. It is really, really nice. Yes, the shower curtain, I've added it to separate the toilet from the shower area. Yes, it is a combo a combo bathroom that is it's two in one we have the bathroom and the shower area at the same time we also have anti-smart it is from kamkunji i got it from kamkunji and i really like it it helps to to prevent slips and falls in the bathroom now this is the door which is leading to the bedroom that is the light switch over there welcome to my bedroom where magic happens which magic anyway welcome to my bedroom i really like this room yes as you can see we have done the makeovers for this room and as you can see from my videos i've done so many makeovers bedroom makeovers for the bedroom i really like this space remember i carried on with the neutral theme with a pop of color to my space <laughs> So comfy, so comfortable. Yeah, this is so beautiful, guys. I really like the combination. It brings out that. So this is my bedroom, and this is how it looks, guys. Now, this is the overview of the room. Starting from the door, we have the dressing table there. It is a major find for this room. I really like the dressing table. It is super cool, super neutral. I really wanted to carry on with the neutral theme for the 
for the bedroom i really like it as you can see this is how i've organized the space we have the necklace vases we have the bible there we also have the face tissues and the face towels over there uh the dressing table came with this drawer that is where i have kept my skincare products moving on to the other side we have also the other drawer that is where i've kept my crunches my my vichana over there and down here we have we have the notebooks extra notebooks and the face tissues over there the dressing table came with this cassette as you can see it is quite small but it is serving the purpose i really like it that is the mirror for the dressing table yeah it reflects the other side of the bed and i really like it the moment you walk in into this real room you can feel the vibe Moving on to this side, this is where my wardrobe is. As you can see, it has been painted white. I really like it. These are my jackets or sweaters. They have been arranged in using the color scheme, like using the order. As you can see, we have the whites, the yellow followed with the bright ones behind them. Down there, we have the extra bed, sheeting, bed sheets and the beddings. We have the towels and also I have the small bag over there. That is how I've arranged my cabinet. The other side of the drawer, we also have the folded clothes. As you can see, we've also arranged using the color scheme. Yes, we have the pinks together, the pinks, the whites together. We also have the colors, the jeans, the dresses separate, arranged separately. And that is the Nigerian bag where I keep some stuff which I don't normally use. Yeah, that is the view from this other side. It looks cool. It looks so good. I really like it. Now, this is my bed. The bed is from Bed Palace, our Janilipa. But let me plug you guys. Yes, we have the bed over there. The duvet. The duvet is from Kamkunji. We also have the throw blanket is from Think Twice. We have some decor pieces lighting up some candles over there. And the tray with the decor pieces there i really like that vibe okay now the the carpet is from kamkunji also it's a five by eight yes we also have the curtains over there but before then let me show you how the room looks from here this is how the room looks i have organized it in such a way we have a passageway we have space to move around the place now on to this side we also have This is the room where I decided I will put everything that I love in here. As you can see, we have lit the candle there. I love lighting the candle, at least my room to smell good. We have the curtains, they are from Eastly. We also have also added a touch of pink because why not add? You know, I really wanted to bring the girly effect into my room. You will never understand how I much how much I love my bedroom. We 
also have another closet over here this is where i usually keep my extra bags up there extra duvet we have the jackets over this side and on a, on the other side we have the extra pillows extra beddings blankets throw blankets all the way up to down there we have the extra beddings and then down here after the jackets we had this is where we keep let me show you keep the extra or the most frequently used dresses ama clothes zenye nikiwa with the indoors natumia to sana and down there we have this drawer this is where naweka sometimes my Kama sahi nimeweka my laptop that is where I keep my laptop. Now moving on to this other side I decided that I will incorporate a mirror into this space. As you can see it really brings in that vibe yeah? room could look so big. Yes, that is the view from that side. Yes, it really looks so good. I really wanted to paint paint it white. Yes, I really wanted it to paint it white yeah i wanted the room to look feminine that's why i went ahead and added the big mirror into the room the reason as to why i want the mirror painted white is that i want the entire space to speak in one voice yeah i want the entire space to speak in one voice For so long I was living my life Oh so wrong Always numb in my mind That old on Building scars from the night So far gone I was blind So now that I found And now this is my home and it brings us to the end of this tour. I hope you've loved, you've enjoyed the video. Subscribe and see new things we are going to add into this space. I'll see you in the next 
one but before then guys i have a surprise for you we are moving out guys to a new place catch me in the house hunting video next thank you so much and remember to subscribe if you haven't remember to give this video a thumbs up i love you so much and thank you for the the love you shown me all the way ever since i started this channel please keep on watching remember to subscribe also remember to share with your friends thank you so much guys see you